Hey guys, what's up? It's Wolf here with Nolan. How are all my adventures doing? Welcome to Rad, which is roguelike adventure in dungeons. Minecraft mod. So I did have a poll up in my community tab and Minecraft won for survival. Well, survival games won, then Minecraft Rad won. I know there is a Rad 2, but I'm pretty sure right now that is still a work in progress at the moment. I think it's like beta stages. So it'll be a while before I will transfer onto that and get the full experience out of that stuff, which I know it's new, newer things added into it just because it's a more updated Minecraft. This is, I think, Minecraft 1.12, if I remember correctly, for the original rad. And that doesn't have a lot of, a lot of the features that new mods are having right now why the new rad 2 has more updated features for the game with that said um yeah this one the poll so this will be the game i play uh, on my downtime i have a little bit of downtime today then i gotta get back to working on my game so let's see uh dimensions not installed flatlands skylands and void i don't know what that is if anybody knows what this is and how to install it let me know and i'll start a new new file uh we're gonna keep on bonus chests we're gonna turn on cheats because i remember this this one time i'm gonna continue on here i don't think i need to set anything else here i think i should be good these are just world things a couple of world things i'm gonna name this suffering <laughs> But anyway, I had this one time where I did not have cheats on. I was in the world and this was actually pretty annoying because this is my first time trying out rad and I got decently, I wouldn't say decently far in the game. I was, I was collecting stuff, got into a dungeon. Then I found like this Enderman Pearl that was a limited use, but I think there was like duration to it. I was throwing it around and I ended up throwing it at a creep. Well, a crypt fortress or something like that. It was like this little black fortress where there's like undeads and you need like a key to get into there. Never figured out how to get in there with or find a key for that. But it was annoying just because I threw it at a wall by mistake and I got clipped into the wall and was suffocating. Then I panicked, threw it again to see if I can get out. I got out, but I was inside of the crypt and there's no way to get out of the crypt without the key. So it was, let's just say it wasn't a fun experience <laughs> at all dealing with that because I died in there and I lost all of my loot and I could not get back in there. All right. So I made a new world. Um, I had to make one just cause something weird happened. But, oh, don't look at me like that. That's a griffin. I don't know. I don't want nothing to do with that. But, um, yeah, let's just say it wasn't the best start. Let's just get that out of the way now. Plus, I figured out that I have a little time capsule that I can just throw down. And it turns into a house. For some reason, the was bugging but uh we also have a vampire book which i don't know that i don't know what it is that's it that's also new so there's quite a few neat things added since like 1.51 which was the last thing i played and this is 1.53 i do have a shader pack on i know a lot of people are like very anal about that but you'll be fine. It's my game, you know? <laughs> but the time castle thing is actually pretty nice. Just having like a portable uh, little stop. I do have Doggo. Come on, Doggo. We still have the same stuff. We still have the quest books. So this is pretty much what we're going to be focusing on is getting quests done. Uh, I'm not looking forward to this one. This is the one I hated the most out of this whole mod pack, which is the whole Amber thing. Like, well, no, it was, yeah, Dawnstone. I, I hated this the most out of every single thing. 
Like, it's the most annoying one. Around this point, I started finishing a little bit of quests, then trying to figure out my key bindings, so I also turned any off the disgusting auto jump. Then I try to figure out my key bindings for Vein Miner, which is apparently bound to my mouse. Well, button five, which is bound to my mouse. And realizing that it's not called Vein Miner, it's just called Extract Ore, or just Extract inside of the controls. So that was fun trying to figure out. Then I had a little bit of fun struggling to place my house. Ooh, okay, so there's obstacles that can block it as well. So I gotta find a smooth service. Oh, this is gonna be annoying. Okay, maybe it's not so much of a gift. <laughs> oh, hi. Okay, so these are the vampire hunters, but I have to find a vampire trainer to become a vampire hunter. I'm pretty sure it's in a town somewhere. Okay. Then I went mining and found a little friendly ghost that wanted to just chill with me for a little bit. Then left me with depression. Oh, okay, so they have a line of sight of where they can see you. Noted. So if I'm in the dark, it takes longer for them to notice me. If I remember correctly, ghosts don't harm me? Hi. Okay, yeah, ghosts don't harm me. They're they're friendly. <laughs> I had to test it, man. I got myself a new buddy now that Oh, okay. Well, he didn't he didn't want to be friends, alright, noted. Yeah. <laughs> Not much of a likable person anyway. <laughs> After the psychological damage that was done to me by that ghost, I now found some arms and some magic crystals that I have to now fall asleep in order to get a random letter for a quest, I believe. Oh yeah. I remember this, so now I have to sleep, right? In order for this quest to continue. Around this point of the playthrough, I actually remember that there is something quite weird with the furnaces that are placed down in the world and the furnaces that is inside the capsule. Around the world, these furnaces are locked to a certain slow speed. But if I make my own furnace and place it, it actually burns like extremely quick so with me using this furnace it's going to be like yeah generally like 10 seconds 10 to 15 10 to 12 seconds for the burn but if i make my own and place it it's going to be at least two seconds for the burn which you will see right now oh yeah i remember playing last time and there was a bug with the furnace that makes it like very, very slow. I remember, I think I had to create my own or plate replace this. Because for, for some reason, it's extremely slow. Did that work? Let's see. No, it's still slow. Has it been changed? I gotta go get more stone and see. Okay, yeah, okay. So I did have to make my own furnace for it to burn a lot faster. And this stuff can be turned into iron. Or it can be used as coal. Can I capsule anything, I wonder? Okay, I found it. I found it. Button five. Oh, found it. Okay, that's that's vein miner. Found it, and I broke my my axe out of that too. Fun. <laughs> All right. So it's it's bound to one of my mouse keys. This is, this is great. We're learning now. We're figuring out everything. Okay, this is not going as fast as I thought it would. 
Is it because I re basically reset it into a, like a normal furnace, maybe? Just because I put it in a capsule? That could be the reason. As I start raiding through these mines, I come up with a little name for my doggo. You know what? I'm going to name you Smith. Smith seems like the perfect name for you. You are my companion dog now. Good old Smith. Now they be like those generic owners, you know? Come up with those weird, uh, like, human names. <laughs> okay, I think we've explored enough here. But as I thought, it wasn't going to be easy to just leave the mines in the safe environment. Because there's nothing safe in Minecraft, and I experienced a near-death experience. It's still daytime, Smith. We have a lot of things to do. Oh, well, it's 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 almost not daytime, Smith. <laughs> ah, Smith, help. <laughs> ah, Smith, attack. <laughs> Where are you coming from? Oh, oh, no. Oh, no. Oh. 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 That could have went south. Very south. I feel like I'm more safe in here than I am out there. <laughs> oh, oh, I almost died. Oh, Smith, you're alive. Well, what was that, bro? You you didn't help me or anything. You were just like, nah, dude, you got this. I'm sure, dude. Like, come on now. After my near death experience, I thought to myself, OK, it's time to go ahead and mine on out of here and finally place down my house. But as I placed down my house, I found a little village, also a wizard tower in front of my house. I don't know if it's ever going to come back and bite me in rear end, but we shall see. I decided that we should definitely just stay there for the day and just raid the village. Huh. It's daytime. It's, it's fine. We're out. At least I hope so. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're out. Side. So it seems like we haven't gotten rid of the the end little ender plants. Good to know that they are still as deadly as usual. And I hate them. <laughs> Good to know. Now I have to build my house somewhere. Is it wise to build it towards a wizard? Because <laughs> I'm pretty sure there was a oh oh, oh water. Pretty sure there was a with oh god, the Griffins too. You know what? We shall build it here. I shall come to regret this decision, maybe, but we shall build it here. Let's just hope it doesn't come to that, okay? All right, Smith, come on, buddy. We have lots of exploring to do. And we have lots of, ooh, chess that I could have definitely used a while ago. Okay, get rid of all of this, all of it out of my inventory. Then we're just gonna reset our brains here. First, we gotta get rid of the furnace and make our own. Oops, give me the stone. Put there. Well, we're gonna take this, put this on. Now we feel safer, right? Okay, maybe saw so, maybe a little bit on some of the gears, not all of them. But you know what? We we still feel somewhat safer than we already did. <laughs> now 
Let's see. Furnace there. Coal. This. An arm. Was my theory correct? Okay, that's the normal one. Okay. Yes, that's exactly how I thought it was. Making your own furnace is more valuable than using one that is spawned inside of a house. If I put it inside of the capsule, it turns extremely slow. It just reverts back to its old self. So, noted. All right, we, we have that figured out. Everything's good on that. Good thing we had, a, we had time to reset our brains and put that together. So we have ores, we have, I'm gonna take this pickaxe with me, just in case. Uh, we'll take our axes with me and we will take apples. And if I remember correctly, uh, apple, well, each time we eat, we have a chance of getting an extra heart too. So we have to actually eat a lot and be in combat a lot or be sprinting a lot or taking a lot of damage. Okay, we got copper as well, nice. And it seems like we've been through a lot of quests already too. Uh, Smith, why are you outside? Um, oh yeah, and then there's a little mine shaft that you get. I don't know why there's uh, leaves down here though. Oh. And there's that achievement. Ooh, I think I might have dug through um uh... Oh. There's emeralds here. Well, I feel like I've dug through a palace. Oh, I can't break that. That'd be a bad thing. What is permafrost? I know there was a way to like instantly get up a ladder. I just don't remember how. Okay, and this is the thing. All right, so these trees are going to be griefing me as I come down here. So I don't think I can do the ladder strat anyway. I think it was one of the books, right? Oh, there's a shortcut key for it, but, um, oh, did I not turn it on? Oh, I don't think I picked one. Okay, yeah, there we go. Now I can add my levels to it. And I can be more of an expert. This critical hits, um, it can try and take less damage. I think I'm going to raise my defense more. That's not something I want to see when I come out here. Yeah, let's lure you away from this. Huh. But yeah, there's a wizard tower over there. I want to head up here because this seems like a village. Oh, God, does don't villages normally get attacked by dragons? I don't know if I want to be here. <laughs> I visited a mountain. Oh, yeah, this is a whole town. Nice. Well, I'm here. I'll just rob you all. Uh, I, I just moved next door and I need food, guys. Don't sit there putting that judgmental look on me. Like, how fucking dare you? You have to eat and survive too, so we're both just doing things that we have to do, alright? So after getting the judgmental look from Smith, I continue to raid the village. While also taking a little bit of a nap so I won't get attacked during the nighttime. But uh, I also realized that there is quite an issue. I went to sleep and I was supposed to get a strange note which is from the quest of breaking those crystals. I did not get that because it's for some reason, the game lags and it delays like anything that comes in. I don't have V-Sync on, so I was thinking that could be an issue, but it is not the issue. 
So what I had to do was exit the game and re-enter the game, which reminded me of why the first group that I had was with me, Perry, and another few people, Shadow, and I think Alice. Uh, that was one of our main issues that uh, was going on, is that we had to reload the game every time it was starting to lag a lot, just to basically refresh it. Ah, I found carrots. Oh, I think I remember an old recipe that I used to do all the time that was actually like extremely good. And it had carrots and potatoes. So hopefully they have potatoes around here that I can actually start a farm with. I think it was like a shish kebab. Ah, potatoes! As I said it, they have the potatoes. How nice of them. Nice house, bro. Oh, uh, you got nuggies? And a shovel? Freaking nuggies, dude? Hey, how you doing? Ooh, for a diamond pickaxe, sir? Oh, dude. Wait, it's two as well. Oh. Oh, I gotta hurry up and build an axe. I need that pickaxe that can actually grab that. Actually, I can. Hold on. Hold on. You stay right there. Do you have a... Yes, you do. Hold on, sir. Hold on. I will be right back if I have wood. The wood is in the house. Not nah, hold on. Hold on, sir. I will be I will be right back, okay? I know where my house is, I swear, dude. It's this way is shit. Or I could just not be a dumb dumb and mark it on the map, you know? That could also help too. I keep thinking that's an enemy walking outside of my house. But it's just Smith losing his mind. I'm gonna need him to calm the hell down, okay? It's like, the well, man... Man's just fucking excited. Walking outside my windows. Here it is. Wait. Okay, I was about to say, wait a minute, that can't do it either? How many was that? Wait, did I drop it? Or does it look different? Oh, there's a strange dream. Is everything just taking a while to spawn inside of my inventory? Because that was not there a while ago. Yeah, I just collected that. And it's not in my inventory. So things are taking a while to spawn in my inventory. That's kind of weird considering it's it's Minecraft. I'm not online, I'm offline, right? That that shouldn't be a thing. Ah, uh, there's a griffin outside of my door. I feel like it's choosing violence towards me. Oh, there they are. Okay, I found them. I found them. They're fine. I have potatoes too. Put those in there. Why is the griffin just sitting outside of my window? Dude. Alright, dude. I'm going to need you to go away. I, I've done no nothing hostile towards you. It's just food. It's food. Okay, okay, okay. Go, 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 go. I've done nothing hostile. Why is it? Why are you lagging? Why is the whole game lagging? It shouldn't be. It's like there's a crap ton of latency, and it shouldn't be the the shader. Because the last time I did this, it. Maybe. I'm not sure, actually. He's not following me. We're good. Now, which house was it? Was it Was it this one? It was the closest one from the big house on... Okay, so probably here, right? No, it's not this one. 
You're trying to keep me out with snow. Alter of Clint? I don't know what that is, but I'm going to take it. We'll find him while we're raiding everything. So around this point, I made a terrible realization. As I was plundering this whole village, as I was looking for this one NPC, <sighs> unfortunately, his item had changed, and it was no longer the diamond pickaxe. It turned into a katana that I didn't have an emerald for. I was missing one emerald in order to get that katana. It was very sad and depressing. I don't know, man. I tried my best. I tried to get it. And apparently, it just wasn't fast enough. I don't want to spend a night here, but it seems like I'm going to have to. Because I don't want this guy to reset anytime soon. But it seems like that's going to be... Oh, that's going to be the thing. Where is he? Are you the guy? Oh, goat for that. Yeah. Oh. There's a house down here, too. Oh, vampiric stuff. Vampire fangs? Blood? Book? Heart striker? Can only be used by vampire players. Huh. Where's the guy? Did he change? Maybe he changed his stuff already. Which would make me very sad. Oh, dude. Hey, hey. Can you, can you not? Get away from me. Help! Oh. Don't you fucking run, you little shit. <laughs> Guys, we don't have a bed in here? Like, really? Is that the guy? This could be the guy. Oh god, there's a riff right there. A katana? What? What the fuck? Damn, I'm missing one. I'm missing one to get the katana, but I do need the string. Oh, and that's actually good. Um, versus this, I'll get my speed back. Thanks for the cake. I'm gonna sleep in your bed. All right, you you can get the other one. All right. Uh, sad news. This was the guy who was giving the pickaxe. I remember now. But the issue is he already changed. So, yeah, the Katana guy, this guy was, was him. He was that guy. Yeah, that sucks, dude. That sucks so much. I was so happy to see that, and now it's gone. Destroyed my hopes and dreams. Pure sadness. Down in the dumps, man. You have something to say, dude, or something? <laughs> Why are you walking up on me like that? Alright, so we started sorting through a few things. Uh, we're going to grab this, take this with us. Oh, uh, this is a different capsule. So there's different house capsules is what I'm seeing here, I guess? If so, that's pretty neat. Okay, so... I wanted to see what were in these. Nothing. It seems like it was only lies and sadness. Okay. Noted. <laughs> oh, they didn't open. Okay, there we go. I got samurai armor, which is extra defense, and I got a shovel. It's a special shovel that hasn't shown up yet, but it's a shovel. <laughs> but anyway, I want to plant some of these seeds. Did it just duplicate? Yeah, it just duplicated because it was lag. Oh, okay then. So that's going to cause quite a lot of issues.
Okay, apparently I cannot do this. What? Um. Okay, so there's clearly a lot of issues going on with the mod right now. I'm going to try and turn off my VTuber and see, is it just my VTuber is taking up too much of the game's processing? Or is, is it just the game lagging? Okay, that fixed that part. So now, where the fuck did my carrots go? Okay, this still isn't working, but I have lost my carrots. My carrots are fucking gone. All right, this is a buggy mess. Noted. My graphics aren't high either. Maybe, maybe it is the shader. Maybe, maybe I'm, I'm using something I shouldn't. <laughs> okay. So, things have come back into my inventory. Now, let's see. Am I allowed to put in potatoes? Okay, no, I'm still not allowed to put in potatoes. I'm actually not sure what is going on. Did I... Oh, it's using my stuff, but it's not processing it. Interesting. So, it's not my shading pack. It's... It's something else within the game. Do I have to close and reopen the game? Maybe? I don't actually know what's going on. This is the first time I've started to run into this issue. Like, like it's just being long term. Like before, it was just like a short term thing. You know, it's just like a few lag spikes here and there. And, you know, that'd be it. But this time it is it is not having my shit but that was like a long time ago i thought it would have been it was just my pc or something some type of issue but no it's it's gotten a lot more aggressive with this bug okay there's my stuff again it's back okay i just had to reload that was the issue but I don't want to have to reload just to fix everything over and over again. That's that seems very tedious and annoying, actually, to do that. Um, I think this is a good point to end off just because I have quite a bit of things to do. Like I said at the start of the video, if I keep that start. But yeah, I have quite a few things to do. I'll figure out what the whole issue thing is, because that's wild. I have to go. Anywho, hopefully you guys enjoyed a few uh, a few of the interesting moments that have went on of me pillaging villages, but or I will just edit this into like one big massive video the next session I do. Hey Smith. Okay, he didn't want to do the outro with me. Anyway, until then, peace out.